Czechoslovakia, of course, taking to the field for the first time in this edition of the most prestigious festival in world football. No doubt looking for a performance to set a tone. There's his great vocal support. There are many, many who have travelled to watch them and every one of those supporters willing them to give everything back for the cause. It is beautifully set here. Minerau, a truly impressive arena here, high up in the great altitude of Belo Horizonte. Slovakia braced for their anthem. The imperative for everyone, three points on opening day. Well, Peter, I can tell you that both managers will have stressed the need for a very strong start here. Both have also indicated a, a front-foot approach. If that is the case, then I don't think we're going to be complaining at the end. I certainly hope we'll be eulogising. There's an awful lot resting on this, and we'll probably end up reflecting on that. So it's down to business here. Tries to get it forward quickly. Plays it out to the wing. Going through. Kubachan. Hit into the middle. It's come through. Hoists it forward. It's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. Duda. And he has been fouled there. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Gets the better of his man. Hemschick drives it forward. Could move up a gear here. Balls out on the left now. And it's Hamschick. Cuts it out. Slovenia have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's, it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Oh, he goes for goal! Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which... Going for goal! Said an absolute gift. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. And it's played forward. Real chance! He's missed, but not by that far. 
Well, even for him, that may have been a touch ambitious. Kuchka. Duda played out to the right. Here it is now, surely. And the shot. And in it goes. All too easy. They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. So that's two now without reply. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Well, he's made sure that that won't get through. Kortic goes looking. Chance! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. And this could be the final action of the first half. That'll be the last act of the first half. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why do they from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Slovakia are in at half time on a comfortable two goal cushion. Already up and running for the second half. Kuczka. Hamshik plays it out to the flank. Kuczka. Hamshik out to the right, back into the middle. Hamshik! And the keeper's relieved to see that disappear wide. Hamshik probably tried a bit too hard then. He should have relied on technique as opposed to power. He's got away. Kuchka. He's had a go. They are rampant. And they are cruising away. Well, that defence just wasn't expecting their midfield to mess up then, so when they did, they were caught completely cold by such a swift breakaway and such a well worked finish, too. Slovakia take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Ilicic looks to get on the end of this. Hamšík. That's 
that's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and defensively, they're alive to his movement and, um, and stifling his threat, Peter. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Hampshire. Good ball. Cut out in the nick of time. All Black gets it away. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. And there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. It's going to be a double change then. That's surely a foul free kick. It is a good finish. The odds were against him, little matter. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. And when the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that play. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. So, is this the start of a comeback? Played out to the right. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. And the counter is on. Zeitz. Ilicic with the delivery. Zeitz. And here's Ilicic. Timely intervention. Hamshik. Duda. Hamshik. He's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Played in with accuracy. Well played, he saw that coming. It's one! Sticks it away! The breakaway clinical and clean, and the finish unerring. Quick, decisive and unerring. A textbook example of, of how to turn defence into counter-attack. That'll do for me every time. He scaffolds his third, and that earns him the match ball. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Every single time he's been in possession, he's looked a threat. Slovakia, and there goes the final whistle. Pretty much the ideal start. A win on the first day, and a platform on which to build. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Listen, ideally, any new campaign needs a start that puts three points on the board, and it's mission accomplished. Nothing too fancy was required, just a, a good, solid team display for me. <laughs>